Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying the Fredericks by Meyer Limited Edition Holiday Chocolate Collection. This was $11.99 at Meyer, Fredericks by Meyer, Meyer brand. Uh, Meyer is a grocery store like Kroger or Walmart, Walmart. or uh, HEB. Probably or, more like Walmart than anything because they sell everything. Probably, but they're a lot more expensive. Just yeah. know that. Um, it's a delectable assortment of chocolates perfect for the season. This is an eight ounce box. It's 16 pieces. The thing about this box is it, it shows the picture on the front at the picture on the back. It does not tell anywhere on this box what is inside the box. What like, holiday flavors? The, yeah, you have a no idea what flavors are in store for you. Hopefully it has something on the inside. What do you mean? Like a little cheat sheet. Oh, a sheet. cheat sheet. Yeah. Well, surely to goodness. Maybe not. Well, Can you surprise. imagine not knowing? Uh, nope. You would think that... Nope, you're oh, just gonna get surprised. No, unless way. it's in the underneath of it. I doubt it. But How could that be? Nope, you're just gonna be surprised, flavors. We're, now we're gonna have the fun part of guessing. Oh my gosh, why would they do that? I'm just shocked. Somebody in marketing didn't think about it. No, they didn't because I tell you why. Kevin and I reviewed another box. It was like the spring collection, mm -hmm. Fredericks by Meyer. Right here, where it's the, where this says it's a delectable assortment of chocolates, it actually told the exact names of the chocolates on there. We knew exactly what we were going to be reviewing. Mm -hmm. This is a blind box. I mean, th that's absolutely ridiculous. So this, there's eight servings. Two pieces, 28 grams or 130 calories. So how many different ones are there? Uh, I don't know. I thought about taking them out. Okay. So okay. we got, so we got uh, milk and dark chocolate. By the way, this looks a lot like a box we tried recently from Chocolate Chocolate Chocolate. Um, and we didn't care for it and, at all. So I'm hoping this will be better. But it looks like the snowman look very similar. This egg, I'm assuming this is eggnog. It think, looks it dead looks like, And that's the only one. Yeah. I, Kevin, I think most of these are all different. Okay. Because look, one that one's square. Yeah. That oh. one's a square. Yeah. This one's a square one. That's a circle. And it's dark. This it's dark one has milk. like basil this is on sea it. Salt. Oh, it it's has, green. It has green stuff on Matcha it. Tea I think every single one of these are different except, except for, for the, the two snowmen. snowmen. Yes. Except for the two snowmen. These. Uh, so you get like two milk chocolate and two dark chocolate we don't know if they're filled or not because lord forbid meyer tell us so you get uh two four six eight ten twelve fourteen uh, different flavors that's pretty good um it says uh, two pieces uh 28 grams 130 calories so and we'll have a picture from just so you can see everything at the end yeah okay you want to try the white one okay I mean, I don't that's know. fine. Do I would have tried the snowman, but that's okay. Just you me. want to try milk or dark? <laughs> milk. No. That's just me trying the snow. I don't know because you get so many. I can't believe there. you can have a ten. They're selling a box of chocolate with no information on it. Who? I don't know of any company. Very few companies do that. Is it cheap? <laughs> Actually, even the cheap ones put names on. Mm-hmm. It's a nice chocolate. It's had a little, um, like a chocolate cream inside of it, like a mm -hmm. little, little bit of a truffle kind of cream. No wrong with it's it. not bad. It's not uh, like luxury. It's no. not rich, but there's nothing wrong with it. It's, it's just good. It's sweet. It's chocolate. I mean, it's just it's plain sweet. milk chocolate. Um, these are distributed. By Meyer place. Distribution in Grand Rapids, Michigan, www.meyer.com. The other one you got the head, now you get the butt. Dark chocolate's definitely more um, like harder, like crunchy. Mm -hmm. You know what though? I like the dark chocolate more than the milk chocolate. It has a richer flavor. It has it? a richer flavor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It just tastes better. It um, and it doesn't taste like dark chocolate. It tastes almost like semi-sweet. Yeah, it's kind of in the middle. Mm -hmm. It's probably like a fifty percent dark. Now, something. this makes sense. Maybe not even that much. In the ingredients list, something in here is saying peppermint oil, which makes sense. Mm -hmm. 
something in here is saying raspberry juice and raspberries. And something else is saying cinnamon. Do, is that like the same as our, like, little white? It looks a little different, doesn't it? Yeah, a little bit. Okay, what do you want to do? You pick one. I picked the salmon. I, I would just go with the white you one. You go with the white one. White chocolate's usually kind of sweet but plain. Yeah. Well, and that eggnog kind of looking one is going to be... Now, we will not have pictures of the insides. Mm -hmm. I wonder if they were supposed to have some on the inside, but you know, even a piece of paper would be nice. The time to have that information is when you're standing there wanting to buy it. Mm -hmm. What flavors are these? And we read all over that box. That might have a little bit of a nutty flavor. Do you get a nuttiness? I don't know what it is. I do, but it's not hazelnut. No. It's more like a Nutella type thing. Yeah, only like an almond or something. Yeah, it, it's, I mean, I know I'm saying not hazel. It's not a natural hazelnut flavor. Right. It tastes more like a very sweet Nutella. Yeah. Is what that tastes like to me. Yeah, except it doesn't have the hazelnut flavor. Right, exactly. It's, it's a little bit of a nutty flavor, it's but weird. it's not hazelnut flavor. Okay. Maybe it's like almond or something. I don't know. Pick it it could be one. just chocolate. It could be a, just a dark chocolate. You pick one because I pick. I had two stomach. Okay, let's do the chocolate with a little white whatever that is. On okay. It. Looks like a cookies or something. Try not to. Here, you take the bigger piece of the It looks like the same chocolate cream. It's very sticky. Mmm. That is um, like pudding. ginger. Mm-hmm. Ginger. Mm-hmm. Never gingerbread. That's what those little pieces were on top. Those were actually candied ginger pieces. That's what that was. That almost tastes like a eggnog almost. It's 100% It's more ginger than mm -hmm. nutmeg, but. It's 100% ginger pieces. I really like that. You need to like ginger. Got a little burn to them. Mm -hmm. I don't think most children would like that. At least no, not most American children. Most kids children. aren't gonna like these anyway. Um, but I really do like the ginger like flavor it. in that. And it does, like I said, it's got a little burn in the back of your throat from the ginger. Mm -hmm. Not a lot. Just a little. Let's do this one. I'm guessing caramel or some kind of peanut butter. I'm guessing caramel. That's why I chose it. Ooh, it caramel. is caramel. <laughs> we were both right. You know, funny how most square mm -hmm. chocolates are caramel. Mm -hmm. And round ones and rectangles are usually creams. This is some kind of truffle cream. And the rectangular ones are usually some kind of fruit uh, berry cream. That caramel, it's not bad. There's nothing wrong with it. It doesn't have a rich mm -hmm. flavor. Like a buttery. Right, but it's not bad. It's not a bad caramel at all. Mm -hmm. I think anybody would be very pleased yeah, with that. I think it's a, why don't we try this one? It yeah. looks like it's got sea salt or something yeah. on top of it. I was thinking you would choose that one or, or, or a different, another one that's similar. Okay, so that this is caramel. caramel. So I wonder if it's just sea salt caramel. No salt. This is salt. Definitely. <laughs> no yeah. doubt. If that was the same one with just salt on it. Mm-hmm. Mm. I like that though. Which one do you like better? The salt. <laughs> Always. Caramel with salt. Always the winner. Mm-hmm. No, that I love that one. Mm, that's really, really good. It really um, it brings up the flavor of the caramel. Mm. It, it it just it takes it up a notch. I could have a whole box of just that. Yeah, they're very, very good. That one is delicious. Mm. Okay. What do you want? This one. I'm thinking that's gonna be a caramel too. I don't know why. It's a milk chocolate one, but it has thin white um, caramel. But it looks like it has nuts in it. Oh, it's a nut. Do you think those are walnuts? Mm, that's a pecan. I'm pretty sure it's a pecan. Something has peanuts. Mm -hmm. Pecans. It wasn't peanuts. It's definitely pecan. Oh, no. Something, in he something else in is peanuts. Here, yeah. That's a pecan. This 100%. is pecans. Mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. It didn't. You didn't get it until after you chewed for a while, and then but it kind of developed into like a yes. Then you get the nutty flavor, kind of like a butter pecan kind of flavor. Mm -hmm. I like that one too, mm -hmm. but my favorite of those uh, three is the salted. Oh yeah. Okay. You would rather the last Your turn. Yeah. Well, besides the peppermint. Right. We'll try the peppermint back to back. That way we can see what the difference is. Is this another caramel? No, it's some kind of. Uh, it's softer, like a nugget. Oh. A nougat. Do you think that could be a peanut peanut could butter? Be. It is peanut butter. I can smell it. That's where your peanuts are. Mm -hmm. The big square of kind of cheap taste of peanut butter, but it's not bad at all. Um, this doesn't have that. It's actually really nice. It's okay. It's, it has. It doesn't have sweetness. that sweet, uh, uh, salty flavor that like we like. It's not as sweet or as salty as Jip, but I yeah. do think it's really it's okay. close. I think it, I think it's close. I like it quite a bit. It reminds me of like a natural peanut butter. I'd probably. rather have the grittiness of a uh, Reese's peanut butter cup, yeah, well, but I, do, I actually really do like that. It's okay. It, it, it tastes more like a natural peanut butter. Mm -hmm. It's very nice. It's okay. I like the texture of it. It's very creamy. Let's go for the green one. This one has green it's flakes like, on top of it. I'm going to guess it's like matcha or something. Well, I know during that springtime collection, we had um, those flavors were mint truffle, white truffle, rose tea, lime, mm. coconut caramel, peanut butter truffle, sea salt caramel, and pecan caramel. So this one might be, hopefully it's not rose tea. No, definitely not rose tea. Definitely. You know who you sound like. Green man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, that's mint. Mm -hmm. Those are the green ones. It's mint. No, I, I mean, mint leaves are green, but you don't represent mm. mint with green. That's dark chocolate and mint. Mm -hmm. you know, it's, it's pretty dark. I like it. I think bitter. it's nice. It's not bad. I like it. It's just the chocolate is really, really dark chocolate. I and like mint's that not like a York peppermint patty mint. That one, uh, because it was like a truffle shape, that ball shape, it had a thicker uh, layer of chocolate on the bottom. And the top was still pretty thin, but that bottom had a the thicker. thick, I like that quite mm -hmm. a bit. The, tooth, um, the toothpaste. The mint is not, it does not remind me of the toothpaste. No, it's it's pretty, like a true mint. It's like a yeah. mint like leaves. Mm -hmm. It's like a more natural mint. I thought it was really nice. It's good. It's good. The, the, the chocolate's a little dark. Want to try this one? Yep. I'm guessing the other one with the red one. Like I raspberry. think it's going to be raspberry. Definitely raspberry. Definitely, definitely. definitely. <laughs> wow. Don't. Now you gave me three, mm -hmm. four. Yeah. <laughs> give me give the big these huge pieces. This is like a. Almost like an alcohol. Maybe a champagne or something? No. Maybe. Yeah, it reminds you. Mm. We've had those like Marc de Champagne truffles. And yeah, that wasn't as good. <laughs> this wasn't as good as that. Right. Those are better, of course. But this reminds me of that flavor. Mm -hmm. we'll that know. champagne type. So I have no idea what they're calling it. But that's what it tastes like. It could like. have been a chocolate truffle for all I know. It tastes, it tastes like but it, it does is have that champagne. It does have alcohol kind of flavor. Okay. Okay. This is the red swirly. It one. should be raspberry. It's the crazy eye. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Looks like that the snake eyes in uh, the Jungle Book. Mm -hmm. Trust in me. And his eyes start going around. Yeah, we got that one pretty equal. Okay. Doesn't look like. Oh, yeah. You could, well, the minute you put it in your mouth, mm -hmm. you know, it's rather. And the sea. Not bad. I like that a lot. Not bad that at all. It's a little bit of a sharp raspberry. No seeds. Mm hmm. Shouldn't have any seeds. <laughs> no, that's actually a nice raspberry. Mm -hmm. It is a little sharp, but. Mm -hmm. It's sweet. Mm -hmm. But it does have a sharpness to it. Yeah. And a little bit really of good chocolate. with the, the dark chocolate. Mm -hmm. I think that's delicious. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, I think this box has gotten better. 
uh, we started with the just the plain milk, mm -hmm. but then we had the plain dark. But I like the dark, and it's just gotten better. I think. Yeah, the flavors aren't bad. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm gonna do this white one. Yeah. We're assuming this is eggnog. We don't know. It looks like it would be eggnog, and the other one was clearly ginger. So this it would make sense if this did have the nutmeg, and then we'll do the two um, oh, yeah. uh, peppermints. It smells like eggnog. Mm hmm. Yep. Mm -hmm. It's funny, they'll do eggnog flavor candy, uh, chocolate over here. They would never do that over in like the UK or. No, they should though. You would like it. <laughs> I would love for everybody to be able to try eggnog. Mm -hmm. Really. Some people have problems with the texture because it's really, really thick. Mm hmm. It's like a, a custard, but it's not quite custard. It's thickened milk. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Um, but it's got uh, nutmeg and, and cinnamon and stuff. That's what that was. That was just classic eggnog. Mm -hmm. now, the seasoning, the spices actually weren't as strong as I was thinking they would be. No, and it was very sweet. That's what mm -hmm. I was going to say. It, it's it's very, very sweet, but it does have that nutmeg flavor yep. to it. Yeah, eggnog, actual eggnog is a little, a little more um, spiced. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Th that was that was a was nice chocolate. Yeah. Okay, so you got dark, I think looks like one, dark and milk. I think this one's going to have, I don't, I think they're both dark, and I think that one's a caramel. Mm -hmm. Might be. Drop that on my lap. After he stab myself. stabs himself in the groin. <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> okay. Let's see. That looks like a caramel. Mm-hmm. That one's a caramel. I never know. It goes really well with the candy, but it's not crunchy. No, the candy's not crunchy at all. Mm -mm. But I do think the caramel, chocolate, yeah. peppermint, candy cane, I think all that goes well together. Yeah, it's definitely a candy cane peppermint mm -hmm. too. Mm -hmm. I like the, 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 the caramel adds a, a thickness to it, yes. and I, I like that thickness. I think it's very nice. Yeah, that's nice. So this is going to be basically just a truffle form of peppermint. That's my guess at least. Okay. These are really hard to cut. I know, you said hard. Ooh! This one was a surprise! Pink. Oh my gosh! I'll stick that away. Yeah, the caramel was not pink. Now I did get a piece of... Um, a piece of that candy was crunchy. Not all of it. But I got like one little piece that was crunchy. Oh, it's, there's just, no one. it's just like a peppermint cream on the inside. Mm -hmm. They didn't have as much peppermint flavor as that the caramel. No. Though. I thought the it's nice, mm -hmm. but honestly I got as much equal dark chocolate as I did to the peppermint in yeah. that one. And the one before it. And you really got the the candy, the, the candy, candy more. Flavor. Yeah. Um, I like this box. I think it's a good box. I think it's it good $12. Box. It was $12. I think it's worth it. For a gift, if you're going to yeah. give this to somebody. I mean, you know, when they say $10 gift, you can really fudge a little bit. I think this is a decent $10 gift. However, they really, really they messed up. It. They needed to label that. I mean, I'm glad at least they did give you the ingredients. Yeah. I mean, yeah. So, I mean, if you have an allergy, you better just be reading the ingredients. Yeah. And you would anyway. If I had an allergy to something, I would be reading all the ingredients too because you don't want to, you know, have an outbreak or something. Um, but they need to label this box. <coughs> you need to know exactly what you're getting. They'd probably sell more of it. If they uh, I think they would sell more. Yeah, I will be curious, very curious to see how many of these they have left over out of the holiday. And of course, some people are just going to buy them blindly. They're going to be like, give them more. I need yeah. a... A gift for Bobby Sue and so I'm gonna grab this and not even look at the box to see what's in it some people won't care um, but uh, most people want to know what's what they're getting mm -hmm. for that for 12 bucks you want to know what you're getting and I think that was a big yeah. number I do think a majority of the chocolate was good I do too yeah. I think the the most uh, disappointing one was just the plain milk chocolate 
just because it's just plain milk yeah. chocolate. It wasn't really rich or anything like that. It wasn't like Cadbury or Kinder no. or one of those. Um, but I did like a lot of the other flavors. Yeah, this is on par with the Whitman's and the Russell Stowers. I think this is I think about, so too. A, it's about on a level. I think they did a good job. I, I, one of my uh, favorites is absolutely the sea salt caramel because I yeah. love the oh, salt. Yeah. But then I really, really do like that ginger one too. I the love those ginger really pieces. I actually like the raspberry one too. Which like the raspberry, scary. like the eggnog. Yeah. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of good flavors mm -hmm. here. So I think you're totally safe oh, to one, get this. The caramel with the little pecan on it, that was really good. Yeah, that was good. <laughs> yeah, but yeah. I even liked, I liked it more than Kevin, the peanut butter. I thought the okay. peanut butter was yeah, good. Yeah, the peanut butter was okay. Um, but they gave you a lot of it, that's for sure. You only get one piece though, so you better enjoy it. That, you know, that goes for all these, except for the snowman. And you really don't want the little chocolate. Oh, they always have like their signature special Right. shape one and that's it that's okay. it yeah so i hope you enjoyed the video this is definitely much better than the chocolate 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 box that we tried I, we were very disappointed in that one and um, i remember saying that i was sorry i wasted my calories on it right. this this was worth yep. eating yeah, yeah was good. so i hope you enjoyed the video and you'll have one picture of that chocolate <laughs> at the end and thanks for watching mm -hmm.